I guess it depends on the question. If the question comes from my mom, like she normally do, like, what are you doing in your regular day? The answer, I guess, is like to be in front of the computer every day. So the idea is not like so romantic, like to be in the telescopes, observing stars at night. So every day we just sit in front of our computer and do work, basically. If the answer is, I mean, the question is like more professionally or what, what do you, what are your goals or something like that. Well, we research, so basically we program every day. So we use different languages to program based on science and obtain results and try to improve our knowledge in general. From my point of view, astronomers study everything that is outside the Earth, from the moon to the most distant object in the sky, uh, the quasar. Um, as he said, we we don't spend the uh, nights and nights in the telescope. Basically, you go there once in a year and then you analyze those data the rest of the year. Or, for example, in my case, I've never been observing. <laughs> I'm, there is another kind of astronomer that uses sat data from satellites, so we never get the opportunity to go to an observatory and look through a telescope. Working in the stellar population group, so basically what we do is like observe a specific objects in, in galaxies uh, where they have uh, properties that allow us to obtain information of the galaxy or the stellar population in in general uh, in the universe and that the specific uh, population in my case are uh, star clusters that they are really uh, old or some of them are really old so uh, allow us to determine uh, the, the story of the evolution of a galaxy in in our case. In my case I have two different parts, two very different parts. One of them is science where I study microquasar. Microquasar is basically uh, a small black hole close to a star. And what I study is the fast variation in the radiation of the, of the microquasar. So we can know what is happening there, how they form. And finally, how, since the, the beginning of, the, of a black hole it's the death of a star, we can know how the star death died. And on the other hand, I'm doing instrumentation, I provide the instrument that other astronomers are going to use. So right now we're building an instrument for the GTC, it's, a, it's a, the biggest telescope in the world that started working this last year. And here in the University of Florida, we're building one of the instruments that astronomers are going to use to collect data from the most distant object in the sky. Well, I guess that most of the people said because I really loved when I was a child to look at the stars or something like that. And I guess it's true for most of us, and at least in my case. This is like a more vocational uh, profession than the rest of the cases because it's really hard our lives are, are not like eight hours in a company so this is really because you want to do it you really like it from, from ever so yeah I, I guess since I was a child that was my option it wasn't any other <laughs> option it was this option I never thought about it in my life until I came here to the United States I never thought being an astronomer I studied electronic engineering that's why I'm building instrument. Um, basically it was because of her. She studied, started studying astronomy. So if I wanted to be here with her, I had the opportunity to start studying astronomy. And now I really like it. Uh, yeah, it's not really too much. But I guess weekend, what I really like is sleep. I really love sleep. I know I know it's weird because we're supposed to work at night observing and sleep during the day, but I really love sleep. I really <laughs> love to be in the morning, reading the paper, the newspaper, or whatever. So since I cannot do it during 
my weekdays, I try to relax during my weekends. And I guess that the second most thing that I do is I really love, enjoy this weather that I really like, uh, Florida. So I try to go to the pool and relax, breathe there and lie on the floor and enjoy. In my case, <laughs> I really, really like playing soccer. I play soccer three or four times a week. Also, um, now okay, so it seems like I'm really lazy, but I really <laughs> like to do a step. I'm addicted to a step, and I try to do as much as I can because it seems like I'm really lazy. And well, it's true that I'm lazy, but not always. You can well, continue. We are trying. We are now learning to roller skate. It's our next purpose. So. Um, Right now we have been learning for a couple of weeks. We already can <laughs> roll a little bit. Uh, also, I like to surf the web, but since I'm most of the time in front of the computer working, when I arrive at home, I don't have the... How do you say this? <laughs> I, the willing to do it? The willing to do it. So... What we a... love to see, to watch house. <laughs> <laughs> that, that is our moment of the week, watching house. <laughs>